Hi, and we're here with episode 73 of our uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of Duelist Let's Play. So, last episode, we had a little bit of a shadow of a doubt. We took on Misty. <laughs> Misty. Why do I always call her Misty? Carly. And we kind of uh, defeated her using Majestic Red Dragon Archie. And it's cool because we just used Majestic Titus Dragon just before, so we're going to be using Majestic Black Rose Dragon. Hello. Well, anyway. There's going to be some truth about this duel and some consequences. So hopefully we can learn a thing or two and uh, let's go. <laughs> some people are getting so annoyed that I make all these like jokes with the names, but eh. All oh, but one dark side of remained and it was up to a key to take her down. <laughs> nice and short. Not even a minute in and well a minute including the intro. Never mind, someone's going to correct me. But yeah. We good. And it's green as well. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda looking forward to getting out of this little arc. Because as a kid, I watched five of these on the TV, but it never showed past this arc. Like it never showed the one with those people who dressed up in white. So I've never watched through all of it. And to be honest, I know like so much earlier on the series I was talking about how I've been watching 5Ds. I'm still only on like episode 50 something. Hold up, I'll check it real quick. Uh, I use my anime list by the way. Uh, just to double check on everything. I'm pretty sure I'm on like episode 56. Something like that. So, yeah. Well, it's my most recent anime I watched is Devil May Cry. That was actually kind of cool. Started off really slow, but ended up getting really good. All right. Uh, okay, well, it's signing me out. So instead of signing back in, let's go in watching section and see what up. Uh oh. This may be an issue. All right. So you get five of these, fifty-three episodes. Why am I thinking 56? I uh, thing is, I, I can't remember, but I think it was 5Ds where something was happening and I watched a couple but I never got to log it down. I'm pretty sure I'm on 56, although it says 53. Still, I may be on 53, who knows? <laughs> but like, yeah. Um, long story short, I have gotten up to the arc with these white people, so yeah. Huh. Who do we have in... Okay... Welp. I guess we can have some fun tuning right away. I wonder what this thing is though. I don't, I don't remember it. What's your OFS? This kind of looks like a fake Yu Gi Oh card, I'm not gonna lie. It's one of those ones which people would make a little fan out of using some random picture. Uh, once returned, you can banish one plant time from the graveyard, tug one through some monster control, harvest its attack, until the end of the damage there, blah blah blah. Uh, but if he doesn't mean. Banish one monster from the graveyard. Okay. And I go call it, double call it or haunt it. So I can bring back this. I about to say guy, but people get offended this girl right here. So, we'll see what happens. Yo, goodbye. Hmm. Now, I'm just going to continue on. I could have gotten some damage off. Uh oh. Yeah, kinda glad I didn't. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hell yeah. Yes. I like this. Oh no. What's this? Uh, Alright. Continue on. And that's when I use this card. Bye bye. <laughs> yeah. You ain't defeating me with no Earthbound Immortal. Actually. I want to look up uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Earthbound Immortal. 
I want to look at a couple of these new designs again. Dude, I know about you people, but I'm the type of guy where even if I know every single, say, for example, type of Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh card and archetype, I still sometimes I like to go back and just look on everything and double check. And why can't I... I'm genuinely confused. Why can't I attack? What? Is it because of him? Ah, uh, there's no... Okay, there's trouble with his card. Chrono Chrono attack Wait. Oh. <laughs> How am I meant to? What the fuck? Bro, I can't do anything. You know, um, that's annoying. Kind of, uh, forgot about that card. But as I was saying, sometimes I just like going through different archetypes or say. Pokemon typing and just looking at designs, reading through laws, just in Yu Gi Oh! terms, refreshing what cards can do, or just enjoy looking at the design, as I said, just in general, and what the deck can do. And I, I don't know why I'm like that, I just. I do like it. Alright, uh, yeah, you do that damage to me. Wait, what? Um. Okay. Uh, all right then. Hmm. So I need an MST or a Black Rose right about now. Or if that's what it did. All right. Yeah, I wasn't properly reading this. I was just like, yo, what? <laughs> oh, hold up. Okay, so, um, yeah, I kind of got no idea what I should be doing. Kind of an issue. <laughs> uh, Alright, now, I have an idea. This one here doesn't specify what card. So I'm going to tribute itself to get a tuna. Do we have a level one tuna? Please. Oh, hello. The most typical card. I should know. Wall of Ivy, or Ivy Wall. Forget what it's called. In my opinion, is the most typical card that she uses anyway. Now, main issue is we have two called the Haunted, which I probably shouldn't have put down. Probably should have only put one, but I put both just in case. And I can't, you, you can't blame me for that, because uh, it wasn't that bad. It's just this guy came out and it's like, yeah, yo, that ain't good. So right now, we're going to get rid of literally everything, completely nuke the field, which will set up a play for next turn. And just... Okay, well that should happen. And we have this person right here, Violet Witch. So, with our life points, hopefully she doesn't get a monster and I can start to slowly pick her off. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh, gee, this is great. This is great. It can direct attack too. Oh, hello. <sighs> Alright, well, um, unless I get a level 3 tuna next turn, I'm dead. <laughs> That's unfortunate, not gonna lie. Oh, well, I mean, you can attack that. I'm perfectly fine with that. Uh, yes, but you're not a tuna. Hmm. That's an issue. It's a very big issue. Glow up bulb. Definitely a good card. Ah, uh, but... I don't know. What's the best play? You can bring up their special summoner, but then there's no tuna on the field, which isn't good for me. Mm. I'm gonna bring you out. Just because you're replaceable. And you can bring yourself back, I should say. 
Alright, so if you're going to continue to attack my monsters, I will happily set this guy for you. So then we just need a level 6 to get on the board. If we had a call of the Haunted, I guess what I could do. Could bring back the other person. Black Rose Dragon, nuke the field once again, and we would be good, but unfortunately, that isn't the case. And we get another card, which I really have. Ah. Now, hold up, hold up. This might not be too bad. Assuming it doesn't get another card, yes. Kill it. You do that. So now I'm going to bring you. Wait. Yes, you. Because you'll special summon yourself. Then I can get rid of you to bring out Giga Plant. Yes. And then I can use Sport to banish something. And I'm good. Wait. I want to double check. It, it, this can attack me directly whenever it wants, correct? <sighs> ah. Uh. Da -da, your opponent cannot. This card uh, directly. This card. Yeah. It, it just straight up says. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, for a second I was like, wait, can we not do anything? That would have sucked. Okay. So here we want to banish. Uh, you give I. Okay. Wait. Wasn't the other card meant to go off? What? Want a plant type? To, 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 to. Okay. Oh. Get ready for the nuke. Yeah. It's so weird seeing stuff like nukes and yesterday I said World War. What? <laughs> Why the fuck did I say yesterday? I said it because I like. I'm thinking in terms of if I upload this daily. Uh, but yesterday, I mean like, last episode, which is literally like, not even that long ago. Uh, I spoke, yeah. But like, I, I don't want to talk about it, because I don't even think you're allowed to on YouTube. But there's a lot of uh, worrying stuff going on. Okay. I mean... Uh-oh. You can't be serious, dude. You can't be serious. You. I'm straight up saying we won that. We won that. <laughs> Tribute, summon, kill, damage. The only thing that could have fucked us up if that had an effect which prevented damage, I don't remember it doing. And if it had an, she had another field spell. And at the same time, no, we would have straight off won. She doesn't have enough lives for... Ah. Oh. Fuck. You know, if I'm being forced to do this again, I'm straight up going to do it on video because of I don't want to waste time, you know, just, uh, <laughs> you know, doing it again. And since we, we won that game, I'm telling you, we won it. And I don't want to waste time doing it all again and having to get lucky and unlucky and lucky and unlucky. So fuck it, I'm going to use a user deck, so we can hopefully get through it super quick. And uh, to be honest, <laughs> you, some people are going to get angry at me, but when I do reverse duels off screen, and all those off, off screen shenanigans, I usually do the user duel, just because it goes a lot quicker and I can defeat the enemies like this. And uh, you, do, you can go ahead and do that, be my guest. Oh no. <laughs> uh, this is uh, fun. This is uh, great. Now I'm going to have to kill him with Karibo and Dark Tinker. I should use swords to build up Mirror Force. At the same time, fuck it, dude. Ah. Fuck you. Fuck you. Get rid of that shit. I want to attack you directly. Uh oh. Well, that's annoying. <clears throat> Yo. Why? Yeah, I'm not gonna cut out the last duel just because of it. I'm just saying, I just straight up was like, yeah, no, nah, I'm not doing this. I quit. So, uh, 
Yeah, now if Rufi doesn't draw that fucking card, we can get rid of it because I hate stooly bitches and ah! I'd rather just straight up win and then I'll not have to sit here for half an hour trying to win. Alright, how do the underdog great? You know what, she's just gonna get every last card which could do anything to help her. She's gonna get that field spell, summon up fucking earthbound immortal. Uh -huh. No, don't want that in my life, dude. Fuck that. Oh, <laughs> you start with this card again? Ah, you're so annoying. Burn of your Miley. Mm. Oh, oh, uh, that's uh, great. Nice. Fuck. Ah, fuck it. We're doing it again. Yeah, she. Hold up. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Because, uh, looky looky, who we got here? Now, this card, can it be destroyed with battle? No, okay. Okay. Never mind. This is getting painful, dude. I just wanna play. Ah, oh, why did I have to crash? See, whenever I record a Pokemon that's probably, uh, especially my surgeons, when it crashes, people are probably all like, ha. You are such a liar, dude. You're just trying to cheat. Bro, I'm telling you, this shit happens all the time. I hate it. Don't like it. At all. Okay. Oh. At least it's not as bad as, uh... What she was doing before. Oh, man. Please don't have a little zero attack bitch again. Can't be destroyed by a battle. It's annoying as hell. Alright. Ah, oh, of course. Of course you got that guy. <laughs> Why wouldn't you? Dude, this is annoying. I'm just saying. I just want to complete this one mission. Ah, oh, no. No. This is torture. Literally torture. What the fuck? Oh, I should have put them. <laughs> Why? All I had to do was put Manny the bug in defense mode, and we would have had it. I got MST as well. Okay, at least she doesn't seem to have any other monster cards. What if she has a couple of VF banner mortal? That wouldn't be very good for me because if she gets a field spell card and I use MST on this, I'm fucked. But if she had it, then she would just destroy it. Ah, and she's got a set cut. It's gonna kill me. MST. Fuck. Alright, well, um. Hello. Legend. Okay, I'm gonna buy. I can straight up kill this guy. Can only use MST on you. Oh no! Yep, yeah, definitely using MST on you. Fuck. Please don't mirror force. Yeah, I'm just saying. I just ate some rice and chicken and I put some uh, soy sauce thing on my rice. And I accidentally put too much in. I can still, like, sort of taste it. It was so fucking strong. If you've ever had strong soy sauce and put too much, ah, oh, dude. I'm sorry. <laughs> it tastes disgusting. But to be honest, I just deal with it. Like, I, I, I know it's my fault. I put too much, and even if it wasn't, yo, I still ate it. I ate all that soggy soy sauce. Really disgusting rice. <laughs> Yo, Furubo, that shit sucks. And number 500 life points, she's gonna summon out this other bitch! Bah! What if she's just like, Yo, I've been immortal? And that would be. Ah, oh, bro! Come on! Such an annoying little bitch. I'm just saying, you are an annoying little bitch. Uh, the attack of any of those cards. Zero. 
Mm. So I don't understand, dude. How am I meant to get rid of this? Great animation, may I add? Casto. Always going to be a great card. I'm just saying, goodbye to you. <laughs> to you. Casto is great. Originally, I was like, maybe I should just uh, not use Xyz cards because if I'm not in the Zexu era yet. But yeah, fuck it, dude. I'm not playing the story bullshit. Hate stool. Can't say it enough. Double summon. Great card right about now. Uh. Can. <laughs> Fuck you, taking a risk. Yo, risk paid off. I mean. <laughs> kinda. <laughs> Should have summoned Karibo, dude. I could have won with Karibo. And that would have been perfect as well. It would have literally been a perfect 200 life points just if I attacked a Karibo. Yep, nope, now it's uh, gone. Oh, March of the Monarch. Oh, dude. I don't even have that card. You're not, you're not playing Monarchs? Yo. Got a little something for you. Never mind. Wait. Oh, yeah. She, never mind. She's special summon. I'm just. And I got off his health. Oh, my God. Fuck off. No. Stop. Can you not? Can you not? Yes? First. Fuck the fuck off, dude. Goodbye. I don't care. I don't care. Got rid of her life point gaining. Got rid of... Your double summon. Got rid of... The, everything that could have been an issue. And you know what? We can win with Karibo. I don't care. If you guys hate me for this, all I gotta say is I'm not redoing it when I basically won. And we can have some fun winning with Karibo. Yeah. What's happening? Why is Yav shaking? Look over there. Another Dark Steiner, but who would it be? Who could it be? I don't know, but I have a feeling we're about to find out. Yeah. Now, on that note, let's quickly check how many battles we have left in the FlamD's era. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, wait, we have 11. Kind of thought it's going to be a little bit less. What? 1, 2, 3, 4, wait, yeah. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Alright. Yeah, I knew I didn't read wrong, but it's like, ah, I'm recording. What if I fucked up? People are gonna yell at me. Quick, double check. And I got it right anyway. So 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, and that's it. So as I said, that we have approximately 37 episodes of the series left. Yo, I like progressing. <laughs> well, on that note, I'm gonna wrap up this episode here. If you guys have enjoyed my smash review, how you down below? I will catch you guys the next time. Hope you enjoyed. Let me get a pop when the beat goes.